Yeah, me and the Soul family was discussing how it seems like some people have it so easy. You know, how they're able to travel to all these different places, you know, buy luxury items, you know, expensive meals like $600, $600 sandwiches, $2,000 pizza, you know, crazy stuff like that. And the reason why they're able to go to all these different places and buy all these luxury items is because they're not real people. You know, they're a part of the matrix. So it's easier for them to have money. You know, while children of the most high, you know, struggle, you know, just to keep their water on or their light bills on. Yeah, we was having a deep discussion about this. He says, have you asked your woman what she think about a lot of these fake humans that are bots who have it easy to travel to each country each week posting on social media? We both had a talk on that confirming they got it easy because they're zombie bots. All right. Yeah, she really dropped the gem right here. I'm going to read it. She says, yeah, they are not real people. They are robots and clones. I learned clones have been given unlimited money to boast and show off on real people. For us to believe this matrix fake reality is real. And we envy them wanting to be like them, wanting what they have, going out of the way to get it, including selling out. This is what they want so mankind can be destroyed. Even if we work and save up all our money to travel everywhere like them, mankind would still be in trouble and danger because the world reality is not what it seems. And what they show is not the truth. The majority of the people in the world are predators, parasites who own businesses, including hotels, airlines, taxis, bars, clubs, beaches, just about everything we would be doing for fun. They eat human flesh, feed on our energies in every way, including excitement and sex. They put drugs in human food, and monsters take turns, take turns in raping them without their knowledge on these vacations. They will find ways to drink the individual's blood without them knowing, eat parts of their flesh also, or just eat them whole, and talk about those people went missing or they ran away to be in a vacation country illegally. These types of things ain't going to happen to the bots, clones, y'all Y'all see on social media because they are the same thing. Predators, parasites, masquerading in silicone human skin. So they ain't going to feed on each other their own kind. They are condemned enemies of God, the creator. And their end is the lake of fire. And they know it. Someone said this is my hearing. Humans are livestock. This right here is a script. This, this, this right here is what a lot of these honey traps really look like. They're not real people. This right here is... Is what people really be having sex with, but they don't even realize it's not a real person. It's a parasite feeding on your energy. This right here is a scripture. It talks about how they feed on us. For have all the workers of iniquity no knowledge who eat up my people as they eat bread and call not upon the Lord. Psalms chapter 14, verses 4. Yeah, somebody told me a long time ago. About, yeah, about four years ago, somebody was telling me that a lot of these um, businesses are fake. It's pretty much what he was saying. He was saying they just get paid just to simply stand in there. Yeah, so somebody was hitting me to how this world was a stage back in 2020. And I bet you when they go out of business, a lot of times it's not because they don't get customers or enough sales. I think they're just done playing that role. But yeah, these demon terror bots have it easier when it comes to money. Because this is their world. But yeah, that's all I had to say.